This video will provide some hints to help you get started with VexCode IQ C++. C++ is an option in the VexCode IQ program, which is available from the downloads on the Vex Robotics site. In the description section for this YouTube video will be a link to a Google presentation used for the script of this video. Any of the links contained in the video are available within that presentation. VEX Code IQ contains an option to code for the VEX IQ robot using the C++ language. This video is intended for users who are familiar with the block language but new to programming using C++. There are several hints which will be covered in this video to help you make this transition. The first place to start is with the knowledge base articles found on the VEX Robotics site. Due to the fact that VEX Robotics is adding new products all the time, their website goes through frequent upgrades. Currently, the knowledge base articles can be accessed from the support link, then IQ, and then VEX Code IQ. There are currently a number of articles to help with the C++ language and more are added all the time. Should the site change after the production of this video, the articles can always be accessed from the kb.vex.com address. The examples used in this video are intended to be used with the standard drive base for the claw bot. Start by opening up the VEX Code IQ program. From a Windows platform, you can double click on the desktop icon. In order to configure our program for the standard drive base, select the devices icon, add a device, drive train to motor, port one for the left drive, select port 6 for the right motor, uncheck the gyro, select done, and minimize the device menu. A very powerful tool to help you start to learn the C++ language is the code viewer. Click on the code viewer icon to bring up the code viewer. Whenever a block is added to the block program, the C++ code is automatically created in the code viewer window. You can even convert to a text project directly from the code viewer window. If you select the convert to a text project button, a Save As window will pop up to allow you to save the current block project. If you do not want to save the project in the block format, simply select the Cancel button. Now you have the block program as a text project with the new code added and the project is ready to either save, download and run or add more comments to it. Once you are in a text project, you can access the C++ help by clicking on any of the question marks beside each of the C++ commands. This will bring up a window which describes the command and explains how to use the command. The help window can be minimized by selecting the arrow icon. Help can also be accessed by right-clicking on any of the commands within your text project. Select Command Help. This will bring up the same help window. A 
Another helpful feature within the VexCode IQ program is the command autofill feature found in text projects. Let's start with a new text project. You will need to set up the project with a two-motor drivetrain device. One way to access the autofill feature is to click on an open command line and press Control and the spacebar at the same time. This will bring up a window with a list of the available commands. Another way to access the autofill is to type the first letter of the command you want to use on a command line. This will bring up a much smaller list of options. For this example, select drivetrain. Entering a dot will bring up the next set of options from the autofill menu. Next, select the drive for command. This will bring up the next autofill options. Select forward to continue with our example. The next syntax requires a value. Enter comma 200 comma. This will bring up the next set of autofill. Select MM. The next syntax requires a comma. Then select true to make it a waiting command. To complete this command syntax, enter a closed parenthesis and a semicolon. After completing the command, the program can be saved, downloaded, and tested, or other commands can be added. The last area to be covered by this video to help you get started with the C++ language is found in the Open Examples. There are many example projects available and they can be selected by category, such as selecting the drivetrain example projects. For this example, select the drivetrain moves and turns example project. This will bring up an example project with a whole set of code already written to be saved, download, and run on your VexIQ robot to see how this code affects its behavior. If you found this video useful, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. There are many videos of robotics competitions and instructions there. Until next time, remember, sometimes it's better to text than it is to block.